It's the night I know you Mizzou fans have been waiting for for a while after a big debut season as head coach. Dennis Gates opened up year two at the arena tonight. Big roster news though before tip off seven footer Connor Vanover will not be able to play the first three games of this season due to a tournament he played in back in April. You could see him on the court pregame. He's able to warm up, be with the team, but cannot play. Tigers did start off on a positive note though, unveiling a new banner in the rafters for last year's run in the big dance. The slate now though, it is clean. Let's get to to it. Sean East was the man to watch in the first half. Casually pulling up from beyond the arc there. He's money. Quick start up 3-0 at the arena. East was a good facilitator tonight too. Lobs it to Noah Carter. Makes a nice move there under the basket. Good momentum in the first half and that's going to force an Arkansas Pine Bluff timeout. Got to talk things over a little later. How about some flair? Here is the king of it. Aiden Shaw with the first slam of the season at the arena. You love the dish there from Nick Honor too. 20-12 MU on top. Carter, though, wants a little style points here. Gets the dish from Jesus Carolero and gets that one to go. Nice shot there. Carter had 15 points on the night. Second half, let's check in on some of the new guys. Head coach Dennis Gates, he's been talking to us a lot about these guys. Iowa State transfer Caleb Grill. Yeah, I think he's doing okay. Scoop and score and slam. Look at that. Mizzou going to have some fun in this second half. We got a little dunking contest. Now it's Indiana transfer Tamar Bates' turn. One-handed nominee from him. I like it. He goes and makes, 80, makes the 84-53 Tigers. Had to show you this. The freshman Jordan Butler got him to a hundo. Tigers cruised to a season opening win 101-79 to over Arkansas Pine Bluff. This is the fourth time in the season opener that a Mizzou team has scored 100 points. Uh, I think that's a tremendous stat. I think we want to be able to put pressure on both sides of the basketball. We just got to be a little bit more smart. He's been on us about that from, um, you know, since June, even really since March Madness was over last year, like that we was going to have to, you know, build this culture up with the new guys that was coming in.